that's where the whole issue lies in, comes, uh, the whole problem comes in. And we shouldn't blame so much, but where are we coming from as women, especially on the African continent? It is because we are trained to be like that. In, in, we have a statement, women belong to the kitchen, you know? And people have misinterpreted that whole statement the way they want. To an extent that even when these, some of the, uh, the songs that come out, people teach even through songs, you know? There is that song I do not want to hear. Yeah? to have a man, just something of that kind. One of the main reasons why most of the girls dropped out of school and probably they got pregnant during this period, it was because of the long period of the lockdown. And some, and one of, and some of the reasons is because um, some of their parents could not afford, you know, when schools even reopened, some of, the, some of their parents could not afford to, you know, pay their school so that they get back to school. And this historical injustice has existed for centuries. The women have always been neglected in the past. I think they are trying to rise to the man's, to the boy child's standing, if I'm to put it that way, because over the years, a boy child has been trained to be strong. They have been allocated and they have been always reminded that they must be strong. But if we target one group, the other one will not make it. So uh, I think in my own perception, we should also involve men, not in a way of uh, tinkerdizing them, but we also support them and encourage them in order to do more.